name is Steve Mills and I've spent 25 years helping businesses to make more money, to create more sales, to market their business more effectively and then to turn those leads into sales. And I've done that through helping them to create sales and marketing funnels. Uh, just like when you feed uh, a liquid into a funnel, you need enough of it in the top, working it ways down the foot down the funnel, and then the, the liquid, or in this case, sales comes out to the bottom. Now today I want to talk to you about um, some work that I did uh, a few years ago with a, a client called Cascade Events. Uh, they were a client of mine, they were on my coaching program, and Cascade Events um, uh, worked with me, and my objective was to help them uh, to grow their business. Now I'd like to, if I may, just read you what they said about me, then I'll explain to you how we uh, achieve that. So they, they said this, they said, Cascade Event, uh, sorry, let me say that again. Cascade Event Management's turnover hit 492,000 this year. That was up from 290,000 last year. And I'm sure that a significant part of that is down to the time I spent with you, Steve. This year is looking good too, but we still want to take it to the next level. And that's Chris Monk, Managing Director of Cascade Events Limited. Now that is fairly typical of uh, what I tend to achieve with businesses. Sometimes it's like a 40-50% growth. Other times it can be, you know, exponential. You know, I've helped businesses double, triple, uh, and even quadruple the size of the business. So let me just tell you a little bit about Cascade. So they were, uh, as it says, an event management company. They do lots of things like uh, 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 marquees for weddings and things like that, you know, for events and so on and so forth. Now, just to clarify, I want to be really clear here. The, the success that they've had wasn't this year. I'm, I'm recording this in 2020 when COVID hit and so on. This, this testimonial was from a, a couple of years ago, okay? So in the interest of open and honesty, you know, clearly they haven't had the best year ever, I, I am assuming, uh, this year uh, due to, um, you know, pretty much most events being cancelled. So um, that said, how did we do that? Well, as, as I've already said, they, they came on to my coaching program. They booked in for a year and we kicked off by talking to them about what we call marketing without money strategies. There's a way I, I, once we've got established the goals and the objectives and what we're going to try to achieve and the target market and the budget. So that, that's the first phase, as it were. Phase two is, right, okay, so what can we do now that's going to make a big impact on the business that's not going to involve spending a load of money? Uh, let's just get some money in before we start with the money going out. And normally, marketing tends to work the opposite way around. You know, you spend a load of money and then hope that one day you get a return on it. You know, you buy a website for three grand and hope that one day, you you know, your website wins you some business. So we didn't do that. What we did is focused on marketing without money. Uh, so we looked at strategies. You know, we um, uncovered the fact that they weren't keeping in touch with uh, their old customers. You know, and uh, whilst a lot of them were people getting married, and clearly or hopefully they didn't want to get married again, uh, they did have an opportunity for referrals. You know, um, and uh, you know, even at the event, you know, you've got maybe a hundred, two hundred people where there are opportunities for referrals. And so uh, we help them to maximize referrals. We then looked at their actual offering, which pretty much was, um, uh, you know, the, the marquee. What needs to go in a marquee? Well, all sorts of stuff, you know, flowers and, and tables and chairs and catering and everything else that, go, you know, DJ and so on. So rather than just offering, you know, the, the, the marquee, uh, I nearly said tent there. He used to hate me to call it tent. So rather than offering the marquee, he, uh, we, we started offering additional services uh, into the market. 
uh, not, not necessarily always internally. Sometimes we get an outside contractor, for example, for the food. We didn't want to be, you know, hiring chefs and so on. So we got an outside company, but it, it all came through Cascade events. And, uh, you know, they were just two of the things that we did. So we set up the referral thing. We added additional products. We also then, step three, uh, went and uh, looked at what we could do on social. Uh, we weren't really using social. They weren't really doing very much. And so they started posting um, uh, just one or two times a day. That started to increase as business increased. And they started to win, you know, certainly, you know, well over a hundred grand a year uh, on social media. And, uh, and so it just developed. That, that's how they did things. Uh, there were lots of other things they did. They got involved in paid advertising and uh, uh, did, uh, did some leaflet drops and things like that. So there were quite a few things that, that came that were paid, but initially it was all about the unpaid stuff that they did. So, you know, if you want to do that, if you are serious about growing your business, even in these tough times, then um, a couple of things you could do. One, you could book a one-to-one -one with me. Very happy, no obligation, no hard sell. You know, all I do is try and work on your business, demonstrate my expertise, and if you think you can work with me and I think I can work with you, I can talk to you about what else we do, and then you can make an intelligent business decision as to whether you'd like to do that. Or if you wanted to, you could come along to one of my webinars, one of my online trainings. I do them pretty much every day. Uh, just uh, get yourself signed up. They're totally free to attend. And just listen to me for an hour talking about business and, and uh, you know, how to grow a business. And then again, you, you, well, you, again, you can do one or two things. You can either phone me and say, yes, I want to work with you. Or uh, again, uh, take the next step and book a, a free no obligation meeting. So if you'd like to do one or either or both of those things, uh, the easiest way of doing that is to uh, go to my website, which is Steve Mill, sorry, Steve hyphen Mills, Steve hyphen Mills dot com. So um, get that done and look forward to speaking to you soon. Thanks very much for listening.